Nowadays, during robotic, minimally invasive surgeries, two surgeons are needed in the operating room. The main surgeon, who teleoperates the robotic surgery platform, and the assistant surgeon, who uses laparoscopic instruments to provide support during the procedure. The SARS project will allow the next generation of surgical robots to execute minimally invasive procedures with only the main surgeon, without the need of an assistant. Thus, obtaining a reduction in costs, a reduction in hospital waiting lists, and an improvement in the efficiency of the health system. Through the collaboration of nine European partners, including universities, hospitals, and small-medium enterprises, Cyrus will develop a new robotic system, consisting of a pair of cooperating robotic arms holding off-the-shelf laparoscopic instruments. The Cyrus system will autonomously perform specific tasks currently carried out by the assistant surgeon during a robotic or a laparoscopic procedure. Since 2018, the Cyrus Consortium focused on the development of 1. A pair of robotic arms to be fixed directly on the operating table, controlling off-the-shelf laparoscopic tools. 2. A bilateral teleoperation architecture to allow remote control of the Cyrus arms by the assistant surgeon. 3. A perception module to recognize the action of basic surgical tasks and to detect organs. 4. A cognitive module capable of collecting the outputs of the perception module and planning collision-free trajectories of the SARS arms to execute surgical tasks like cutting tissues and threads or holding and moving organs. All these components have been integrated into the first release of the SARS system. The so-called multi-robot surgery platform is composed of a remotely controlled version of the SARS arms to be used by the assistant surgeon cooperating with a commercial robotic system to be used by the first surgeon. Expert urological surgeons tested the multi-robot surgery platform by simulating a robotic-assisted radical prostatectomy RAP, on advanced human abdominal synthetic phantoms developed during the project. The collected data will trigger the implementation of the next two releases of the SARS system. In the first one, called Solo Surgery, the robotic system will replace the assistant, while the main surgeon performs the operation through the console of the commercial robotic system. In the second one, called Lapro 2.0 Surgery, it will play the role of the assistant, while the main surgeon uses standard handheld laparoscopic tools. Therefore, Cyrus Multi-Robot Surgery is the first step towards the next generation of surgical robotic systems merging artificial intelligence, computer vision, machine learning and cognitive control for smarter and safer hospitals.